Welcome, good morning. It's good to have all y'all out there. Um, that's mostly for the people on YouTube. Thanks for watching this, no matter what time it is. Even if it's not morning, that's okay. You may have noticed I started with Transistor yesterday and ended with the Swapper. I hit a snag that I didn't want to have to hit on air. So I switched to the Swapper and I've been really feeling good about the Swapper. I think it's a better game to cast, that it's more fun to watch. Um, so we're doing the Swapper. And with little, actually let me give you a little bit, of, little bit more uh, calendar for the week. So today is Wednesday. Um, I'll do this in the morning today and tomorrow. And then on Thursday, Friday, on Friday at 10 o'clock instead, I'm going to be doing Pokemon for an hour. Um, because Friday is my sleep-in day. And then we'll do this again in the morning on Saturday. So that's the schedule this morning, or that's the schedule for the rest of this week. And then next week we're going to set up, uh, we're not going to do developer game or developer, uh, follower games next week, because there wasn't a very good turnout, which is honestly very expected, because there are four followers right now. Um, but I decided we'd do something else. Anyway, I won't bore you anymore, here's the swap. Um, as far as history goes, you probably remember we had uh, we had a girl commit suicide on us, and then immediately after her suicide, she went ahead and explained how like met us for the first time. She met us for the first time immediately afterward. So that's pretty messed up. That's the real point. Okay, we have three exits to this room. Sample containment metaphysics. Alright, sounds good to me. I would normally go up first because I liked up. And it's not going to work because we need more encryption. Okay, cool. That's good information. Airlock. Oh, is this where she was telling me to go? I need to go outside. Metaphysics. Metaphysics is also locked. That needs to come down, and I don't think I can just swap through it. Yeah, I can't just swap through it. Okay, I tried to swap, but I missed. Dang. Alright. Let's go, let's go try Zinner research. Oh yes. Where we developed the device in your hands. We looked at the way the watch had communicated and built a delivery system for it. To be frank with you, we didn't know what on earth it was at first. It turns out it's what people's souls about. Yeah, that sounds about right. Okay, let's see what happens when I... Yeah, it's the same thing I just did. Can't create clones into that area. Somehow I need to get up through that to get onto that switch, but. Do we have to go back in this puzzle and jump this thing instead? That's what it's feeling like to me. That this ditch here is a trick. Oh no, it's not a trick. Okay, cool. It's it is, however, a way to Man, I'm just not understanding how I'm supposed to get up there.
That's what I'm supposed to do. All right. Cool. There we go. Oh, good. Jeez. That's a teleport, right? That's pleasant. Man, there's so much area here. This is like, this is gonna be a puzzle within a puzzle. Just trying to remember where I'm supposed to be. Alright. <clears throat> Eda, interact with memory tone. Uh, it told me about the swappers or the watchers that are nearby. Alright, well let's try this thing instead. Oh, that is what it is, isn't it? Alright. I figured it out. Maybe not. This is really good game, to, like, as far as flavor, this is really good because, like, normally puzzles like this would be really contrived, right? So you need to create a clone, but you can't create a clone in that light. But in this situation, it's all security measures to make sure that the clones don't do crazy things, right? And I think that's, that's a brilliant way to do it, a brilliant way to think about it, you know? Oh, that's what has to happen. Okay. So, instead of this, how do I just put it over top of me, I guess? Take this up. <coughs> Create a clone here. Man, this is going to be pretty psycho crazy, actually. I really hope this is meant to be a timing puzzle because that's how I'm treating it. That lets me create a much larger area. I need... Huh. Okay. Well. Let's try this. Okay, I want this moved. I want this moved so I can do stuff here, right? I can't swap into the blue, but there's a way I can create. I can create the blue? I can't create the blue, but I can swap in the blue. I can create in the red, but I can't swap in the red. There we go. Alright, cool. Okay, so I have to create oh, one here, move there, so I can swap to him. There we go. Alright. There we go. Alright. I feel like such a baller right now. I can't create. Okay, that's fine. Blue. 
I'm just a little bit too low, but I know I need to create one here and then teleport through this hole to there. So, if I go ahead and I create... The thing I need to do is create in... The thing I need to do is create... Do I need to create through this hole? But the red... Oh my goodness. Is it really that easy? I thought it was much more difficult than that. I guess up there. Nope, can't create through the red. Or I can't swap through the red. But I can create through... Okay, alright. This is... Long walk for short drink of water. Somebody watching this on YouTube will be like, dude, did you did you really just do that? Okay, I got him back. So then I can create uh Created there, move there, swap. And then my flashlight's out of it. Awesome. <sighs> Way too much work. Just the ambiance here, because all of a sudden we've entered like black and white world, you know? And what does that tell us? I, I, I'm just... Okay, so what am I doing here? Looks like I'm creating a clone up there and swapping to it. Then I have to find a way to get through this. And it's going to be the same way I get through the next one, I assume. I can have him interact with it. Oh, I clicked the wrong button. Uh, I guess I hit it too late anyway because it didn't create a clone for me. Um, okay. So what I really need to do is get there. Can't swap through the red. But I can create in the red, and create through the red. Oh my goodness. Well, that's nice. Since it's made up of flashlights, all you literally have to do is cover the flashlight. And find a way to move the box without killing yourself, which is the actual challenge. Alright, cool. Well, that's not how to do it. And I don't block the flashlight, only the box blocks the flashlight. Okay, so the box has to be there for me to go here.
And then there are two flashlights, or two lamps in here stopping me. Okay, but I learned I can block it with this box. That was the point. Can I jump and hit that thing? Either way, I'm going to want to get through the first one first. There we go. Okay, figured it out. They taught me an old trick again. The point is that boxes block the light. Alright, 27. Does that get us through it? No matter how far you dig down to the human brain, you'll never identify something that is consciousness. But the scoffer has taught us that the mind is some fundamental part of the universe which is not physical, and which we can now control. Okay, let me make sure I've been through everywhere. I haven't actually been through this bottom one yet. Okay, so let's go through the bottom one. Oh, goodness. How long has it been like this and not like the Great Chief? Okay, so now I just can't swap, which means I can create. Okay, all right. Okay. Oops. I guess I could have created the guy up there first, huh? Okay. Alright, so I have to be above it when that happens. I wonder if I should be using like some floating magic here for this. Okay, here's what I think is happening, actually. I think I'm going to need to put this here. Yes. 
Okay. So I need to create all my guys where they need to be, and then... And then I need to go, after I've created all my guys in the places that they need to be, I need to swap to them. Alternately. Nope, I just need to create the guy on top. Yep, with this box of course. Over here. Put on bone. Then I'm going to have to just create a swap instead of Got it. <laughs> Man, I rock. All right. Sheesh, all right. Alright, cool. Let's go ahead and see if we did anything to the airlock. Oh, that was brilliant. I'm sure no one's ever done anything that dumb before, right? Right? Of course not. That's the way these games work. Sometimes you do dumb stuff, you know? I already beaten that one, right? Tell me if I hadn't already beaten that one. Xena research. Okay. I've at least been in all those rooms down there. So I have 30 orbs, which is more than enough to get access to the containment sample, sample containment metaphysics. Oh! That's kind of fun. Like, hey, here's a massive laser. To open the door? Attention. Access to metaphysics via sample containment. It is restricted to qualified empiricists. Uh, I have no idea what I'm doing here. Man, I have no idea where I am. Is there a map somewhere I can pull up? I <laughs> like this is the first time I've been like, oh, maybe I should have a map. Well. Okay, good. As long as I go back through the same thing. Sheesh. Do they really mean you just trial and error through that? And then they're like, yeah, let's use these highly intelligent beings as a computer. Cool, so here's a massive teleport that'll take me other places I want to go. There's a mysterious rock sample in here. I didn't use these three, I guess, but I'm sure they connect to each other. Oh, and here are places to try on rooms. Okay, so I'm gonna walk out of here for just a second. The other minds here are always turning. They thought the, of the world as little as we do. Okay, let's see where one of these goes. It goes to a puzzle? That's nice. Thank you. 
Okay. That's kind of, kind of a gruesome way to do that. Alright, I can't swap out of it. I can create a guy up top, though. Okay. Let's fall to death range. I don't really know what this is, and that bugs me a little bit. Let me try... Let me try this again. The thing I really need is a guy up top there, right? No, now we're both kind of stuck here. Oh, not really. Hey, look, I got a guy up top. Sheesh. And then I can create them, but I can't swap to them unless I lower. Oh, such pleasant music, as if this isn't one of the more demented things in the universe. That's no, okay, I'm not just tucking dudes off the edge. Whatever. Huh. I actually have no idea what this guy's supposed to be doing with that. that, like, box. Does the box make it so I can, like, fall and not die? And if so, how do I pull the box up here? Okay, let's start the puzzle over. I'm really close though, I think. Does this look good to you guys? I don't know. Darn it. Oh no, that's what I wanted, except for the death part.
who it is, but I appreciate you following me. It's good to have you guys here. So far, you've just heard me say, huh, Kasha Tito, how's it going? And if I screw up your name, it's because I'm a terrible human being. Oh, dead again. Good morning, we're playing some Swapper this morning. You're the only one here, so I can cater to your, your whims and your needs, if you'd like. Um... <sighs> That's an interesting mechanic. Doing really well, how are you? Very happy to be alive today. Okay. There we go, maybe that'll work. Oh, but then he's on this side. Whatever, okay. Do it like this, and then we'll see if I can take my guy back. Got it. No, but the box is there, okay. Uh, I'm so gonna die. Just laugh at me when I die, alright? That's your job. It is a fantastic game. So you said, I like the Swapper. And it is, it's, it's really good. A little bit of a trip. Um, mixing a lot of moral dilemmas into it. Do you happen to know this puzzle? Actually, I'm not gonna ask for advice. I'd be cheating, totally. But... I think I'm doing pretty well. I don't know. Maybe not. Oh. Snapdragon. <laughs> Saved it. You think so? Because I'm that bad? I don't have CSGO, unfortunately. Yep, that's brilliant. Okay, cool. Ba -dum -ba -dum. No, somehow I lost it. I'm actually not sure why I'm trying to do what I'm do trying to do. Um. There is... There is actually one down here I could use, too. But it doesn't have... I think it lands on. So what's the point of this? What is this? Oh, it must be on one of those as well. This feels like a trick. This feels too easy. Alright. Well. If it insists. There we go, that's what we're supposed to do. And then I can just swap down to him. Man. Sweet. Well, I'm an ultra noob. That's great. Yeah, if I had CSGO, I'd totally do that. I'd be very willing to do that. But, I don't. And I'm too che cheap. Did I run out of clones? 
They're not clones, did they? That's what they're really doing. They're like, you just need to not have clones for a minute. Which makes it so I can't drop a guy there and there unless I think about it like that. Okay. Alright, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure that what I need to do is create him as far this way as possible. Create my clone there to swap to it. Create a clone there. Walk back just that far. Create a clone. Frick. <sighs> Man, I could really use those two clones again. Alright, so that's what they're telling me. Sometimes you have to go reclaim your old clones. Then how do we do that? It's the only way I can think of. Huh. Well, let me go and reset the puzzle. Because I'm pretty sure that's the mistake I made. Oh. Where is there no puzzle reset button? And if not, have I totally... There, there's no way they just made it so I screwed up the game. I can do it like that. There we go. Reset the puzzle. Oh, but I have to swap to that clone. Okay, puzzle reset. Good. So they took two of my clones at the beginning. I don't want them to take two of my clones at the beginning. But I have to do it in order to get over this. Hmm. Alright, well, maybe I'm just supposed to do it with one less. And if that's the case... Oh, there's a, there's a suicide pit for me. Okay, what if I only need one of these buttons instead of both? Yeah, just turning off the red would get me pretty close, right? What if I just turn off the blue? Man, I don't think I have to hit both of the switches. Yeah, figured it out, because I'm so good at this game. <clears throat> I'm incredible, though, really. Listen to me. Okay. So, it works like this. We turn off the blue one. No, I don't want to do it like that. Okay. Alright, we turn off the blue one. Just create a clone up there. And then we move this clone down to that one, so we can swap. Except now I have to... It takes three guys to do that, though. How many do I have left? I have two left. So, I have to have my three guys one way or another. Um, so if I go ahead and put my guy here, then he walks with me, because I'm brilliant like that. Okay, so I'm gonna go here. Get him out of guys. More guys in the pit, but I can't. This way, I can, I can jump the gap. Okay, cool. All right, starting over because I wasn't thinking as I was testing. It just wants to take those two, for me, and I'm okay with that. Cause I can solve this puzzle without those two guys. 
Oh! Good. Okay, I did switch in time. Alright. So. Create the guy here. Lock that guy off the edge. No, I don't lock that guy off the edge. Don't swap to this guy, though. That wasn't very helpful. So close. Uh, okay. So I can create the guy here. Lock him into that wall. What if I... Go up here. Yeah, actually I think that's how I'll do it. Then I can... here we go. <sighs> okay... Then I swap here. Lock that guy off the edge. myself in a place where I can swap to this guy. There we go. Haha. <sighs> oh, brilliant. Well, I'm not running out of guys now. I don't know, I probably don't use many encryption orbs as I am getting, but I'm really enjoying puzzles. Okay, now I'm looking for the reset button. Okay. So what I want to do is create a line of guys. Boop. Boop. Turn it. Just a pile of flashlights over there. Okay, cool, cool. Now that's my victory condition. Let's see here. <coughs> I'm gonna go ahead and <sighs> cause the issue right now is I just need one more guy, right? Okay. Because if I create this guy here, then my guys that I just used stand on platforms make it so I can't switch up there. Alright, so which of these is... So the guy on the bottom is the blue. Blue is what's making it so I can't create a guy in there. So, if I create my line of guys...
so I can create a guy up there. Da, 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 da. Then I create a guy there and swap to him so I can create a guy there. Then I can swap to that guy. Awesome. Okay, looks like I got through those three. I don't know if. Whoa! That face turns to look at me. Jeez Louise. Alright. That's not creepy at all. I'm not creeped out. No, really, don't worry about it. Good heck. Alright. So, here, I didn't finish. Uh, let's see, where's my mouse? I didn't go through the airlock yet. Metaphysics. I feel like I did go through the airlock. I can't go through there. I can't go up there until I call the lift down. Wow. Alright. Don't worry, I only missed the lift earlier. It's nothing big. Okay, we've been going for about 45 minutes. I'm going to do one more puzzle and then I'll be done for today. And I think I'll just count this as a puzzle. See, and she was supposed she told me where I was supposed to go, but I don't remember where that is. Oh, well that looks like a good place to go. All right, get me through the door. Get me through the door. Get me through the door. No, just really through the door. Okay, awesome. Whew. All right, so we're to a massive teleport on the other side. I really should just acquire it so I can jump back and forth if I need to. So here's my new teleport. Memory terminal. Access granted because it takes 30 and I have 39 because I'm insane. All right, so let's just uh, let's just go through, I guess. Because this is where we're going to get more story. Maybe we'll just go one more story. Good show, but we're running out of time. Dennett and I, we underestimated the Watchers. We have to stop them. Looks like gravity control is inactive. Get it online and come help me here. Underestimated the Watchers. Man, that sounds like... Okay, curious what this stuff is. It's just particle physics? Oh. I see. Oh my goodness. They're like, you know what? This game's kind of boring without 15 extra elements. Awesome. We're just going to go ahead and throw another physics puzzle in. Man, I love this game. Oh man, gravity is so upside down. <laughs> yeah, they're all like, we don't understand death. Just, you know, to give you a heads up how little we understand death. You're here. Good. This is the first watcher we've ever discovered. The head. It sorts, filters, and distributes the thoughts of every watcher in broadcast range. It also kills the crew. They're like every other living being in that respect, you chrono them. And the defense mechanisms kick in. Very effective. Something in the air. We probably have a few hours to live. <laughs> Unfortunately, these things are practically indestructible. There's no time to jettison them all and nowhere to run. You're going to have to engage it with a swap device and take control. Uh... Once the watcher mind is in your body, it'll be harmless. Once you're in there, just try to keep it together. I can hunt for you out. I wish you luck, but honestly, should be straightforward. <laughs> what the heck? Get away from that thing. That isn't going to work. Yeah, that's what I thought we were going to have happen in just a second. There's only one way to do this, and it's mine. Uh, is this why she earlier slash later commits suicide? Man. Okay, so. 
<sighs> really uh, under the impression that I should stop now. Some really good story, and it was a really impressive game today. Thank you for following me, Costa Tito, and we will see you tomorrow.